Wake sun and write this to my people and my chosen vessels. My sons and daughters, I have seen the various forms of attacks and ambushes that have been levied against you by hosts of darkness from hell. Your adversary is working tirelessly, seeking ways to weaken you and tire you down. He wants you to be downcast, discouraged, destitute and hopeless. He is unleashing every form of weaponry available. But fear not, my son Jesus overcame him. You will overcome him too. I am now releasing a new and higher standard against all forms of wickedness from the pits of hell a new and a higher standard of praise and worship. I am releasing my holy fire upon you as you praise and worship me. As you lift your voices high in praise and worship to me, your eyes are emanating holy fire. Your entire body will be soaked in the holy divine fire. The gates of hell will not stand against you. I am lifting and releasing a new standard of prayer within your spirit. I am reviving your prayer life with my holy fire. Your prayers are now becoming fire against all forms of wickedness. As you give yourself to prayers, I am engulfing you in this holy and divine fire. Every form of darkness around you is shattering because of the kind of fire that is coming from your prayers. Many of my children have thought that what they are going through is because of their sins and shortcomings. No, my sons, it is because of your steadfast fear, reverence, and stand in me and in my words. Remember, the enemy of Revelation 12 is out to make war with the seed of the woman, the remnant, the bride of my son. But wait to him, for he will fail. And as Babylon is brought down, so is he and all those who worship him and has his mark. My son, let not your heart faint. I am is with you, together with his Holy Spirit, who is in you, and his son Jesus is also with you. We will all never leave you, nor forsake you. I have hedged you in a wall of fire round and about you. Rest your hope and faith in me, for I am able to save to the uttermost. <laughs>